Welcome to another journey. This time we are exploring the hidden gems of Chad, a landlocked country in Central Africa. Chad, a nation that's often overlooked, is a treasure trove of diverse landscapes and rich cultural heritage. From the scorching Sahara Desert to the towering Tibesti Mountains, the country's natural wonders are as varied as they are breathtaking. But Chad's beauty extends beyond its physical attributes. Its unique cultural heritage, a blend of over 200 ethnic groups, adds a layer of allure to the country. Each tribe contributes its own traditions, languages, and arts, creating a vibrant tapestry of culture that's as captivating as the country's physical landscapes. So, as we venture into the heart of Africa, prepare to be amazed by the unseen beauty of Chad. From its vast desert expanses to its vibrant cityscapes, Chad is a destination that promises an adventure like no other. Pack your virtual bags, we're about to dive deep into the heart of Africa. First stop, the Sahara Desert and the Enedi Plateau, vast landscapes sculpted by nature over millennia. The Sahara, the world's largest hot desert, covering an area roughly the size of the United States, is not just an endless sea of sand, but a diverse landscape. It's a symphony of sand dunes that rise and fall like the waves of a golden ocean. The dunes, shaped by the relentless desert winds, constantly shift and reform, creating an ever-changing artwork on a grand scale. Further east, we find the Enedi Plateau, a natural masterpiece crafted over time by wind and water erosion. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is a sprawling canvas of sandstone formations, arches, pillars, and canyons. These formations, some towering over 300 feet, are like sculptures of abstract art, their shapes only limited by one's imagination. Amid this arid expanse we find life thriving in the most unexpected places. Oasis, the desert's emerald jewels dot the landscape providing a lifeline for a myriad of creatures and plant life. The sight of lush green palm groves rising out of the desert's golden sands is a testament to life's resilience and adaptability. The Sahara and the Enedi Plateau are also home to nomadic tribes, a testament to human resilience and adaptability. These tribes, such as the Tuareg and the Tubu, have lived in harmony with the harsh desert environment for centuries. Their lives are a dance with the elements, moving with the seasons, following the rhythm of the desert. As we traverse these vast landscapes, we're reminded of the insignificance of our existence in the grand scheme of things. The desert, with its endless horizons and timeless beauty, has a way of humbling us, making us appreciate the simple yet profound joy of just being. Now that we've experienced the desert's magic, let's head towards greener pastures. After all, Chad is not just about the desert. It's a country of diverse landscapes, each with its own unique charm and allure. So buckle up, as our journey through Chad is just beginning. Welcome to Lake Chad, an oasis of life in the midst of the desert. Nestled on the edge of the mighty Sahara, this body of water is like a mirage come to life. It is an aquatic haven, a sanctuary of serenity amidst arid landscapes and scorching sunsets. Stretching across four countries, Chad, Niger, Nigeria, and Cameroon, Lake Chad is one of the largest and most important inland bodies of water in Africa. It's not just its size that makes it remarkable. This lake is a lifeline for millions of people and a multitude of wildlife species. Imagine an expanse of water that varies in size from season to season, sometimes covering an area as large as the state of Vermont, and at other times, shrinking to the size of Delaware. This ebb and flow of waters teem with life, from the crocodiles that slither in its depths to the vibrant bird species that dot its skies, Lake Chad is a haven for biodiversity. Lake Chad's importance extends beyond its aquatic boundaries. It is the heart of the region, beating life into the communities that surround it. The lake's waters quench the thirst of both man and beast, irrigate farmlands, and provide a bounty of fish. It is not an exaggeration to say that for many, life here revolves around Lake Chad. The people of Lake Chad, a vibrant mix of cultures and traditions, have learned to adapt to the lake's rhythms. The lake's bounty feeds their families, its waters satiate their livestock, and its beauty soothes their souls. They fish its depths, farm its shores, and celebrate its existence. But Lake Chad is more than just a body of water. It is a symbol of resilience and adaptation, a testament to the tenacity of life in the face of adversity. It is a reminder that even in the harshest of deserts, life can thrive and flourish. Leaving the tranquil waters of Lake Chad behind, we now venture into the highlands. We're now at the Tibesti Mountains, Chad's crown jewel. Nestled in the northernmost region of Chad, the Tibesti Mountains rise majestically, a testament to the country's diverse natural landscapes. This mountain range, the highest in the Sahara, 
is an adventurer's paradise, offering a unique blend of thrill and tranquility. The Tibesti Mountains are home to some of the highest peaks in the region. The most renowned among them is Emi Kusi, a shield volcano that stands at a staggering elevation of over 11,000 feet. Its breathtaking beauty is matched only by its fierce volcanic activity, making it a spectacle of nature's raw power. The volcanic activity here isn't just awe-inspiring, it has also shaped the Tibesti Mountains in fascinating ways. The mountains are dotted with volcanic features, from lava flows to hot springs, each adding a layer of intrigue to the landscape. One can't help but marvel at the forces of nature that have molded this rugged terrain over millions of years. But the Tibesti Mountains aren't just about rugged terrain and daunting heights, they're also a haven of biodiversity, home to a unique collection of flora and fauna. The mountain's isolation and diverse ecosystems have allowed a myriad of species to thrive here, many of which are found nowhere else on Earth. From the resilient acacia trees that punctuate the rocky landscape to the elusive Barbary sheep that roam the highlands, the Tibesti Mountains are a living testament to the resilience and adaptability of life. The region is also steeped in rich cultural history. For centuries the indigenous Tubu people have called these mountains home, their way of life, intricately woven with the ebb and flow of the landscape. Their rock art, etched into the mountainsides provides a captivating glimpse into their history and traditions. As we descend from the mountains we find ourselves in Chad's vibrant capital. The journey from the heights of the Tibesti to the bustling city streets of N'Djamena encapsulates the incredible diversity of Chad, a country where natural wonder and cultural richness converge in a symphony of experiences. Welcome to N'Djamena, a city that beautifully blends tradition and modernity. This is the heartbeat of Chad, a place where the pulse of life echoes in every corner, where ancient customs meet the hustle and bustle of a modern cityscape. Ninjamina is a city of contrasts. Its skyline is a storybook of architectural styles, from the minarets of the Grand Mosque, which pierce the sky like a call to prayer, to the sprawling Central Market, a labyrinth of colors and sounds that is a testament to the city's vibrant energy. The National Museum is another must-visit. Here, the pages of Chad's history come alive from the prehistoric Saharan era to the modern day. The museum is a treasure trove of artifacts, each piece a silent witness to the country's rich and complex past. But Nijamina isn't just about the buildings, it's about the people, the culture, the food, and the music. It's about the lively street cafes where locals gather to sip spiced tea, the aroma of grilling meats wafting through the air in the evening, and the rhythm of drums and string instruments that sets the city's soundtrack. The Grand Mosque, a symbol of the city's deep-rooted Islamic culture, is not just a place of worship but also a beacon of community and unity. Its towering minarets and ornate archways reflect the city's rich cultural tapestry. And let's not forget the Central Market, a bustling hive of activity where everything from vibrant textiles to fresh produce and local handicrafts can be found. It's a sensory overload, a place where you can taste, touch, and smell the essence of N'Djamena. In the heart of the city, the rhythm of life beats strong. Every street, every corner, every face tells a story. This is N'Djamena, a city that wears its heart on its sleeve, a place where tradition and modernity walk hand in hand. We've now come to the end of our journey, but the adventure doesn't have to stop here. We've traveled through deserts, lakes, mountains, and cities, discovering the best scenery Chad has to offer. We've journeyed through the sun-kissed Sahara, marveled at the majestic formations of the Ennedi Plateau, found tranquility in the serene oasis of Lake Chad, dared the heights of the Tibesti Mountains, and immersed ourselves in the urban charm of N'Djamena. Each destination, a testament to Chad's diverse and enchanting landscapes, each moment, a cherished memory etched in the sands of time. We hope you've enjoyed this journey as much as we have, and that the allure of Chad has sparked a wanderlust within you. Don't forget to show your support by giving this video a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel. Your engagement helps us bring more of the world to your screen. What part of the world would you like us to explore next? Leave your suggestions in the comments below, and we might just take you there. Until then, safe travels.